here is Kalani with the investment. Oh, Abby, you're so misunderstood. Sure, you can be a little mean sometimes, but deep down, you just want to raise some of the best dancers in America, and there's nothing wrong with that. You knew from the start that Kalani Hilliker had star potential, which is why you offered her a spot on Dance Moms. Kalani is a stunning girl. Clearly, you have an eye for choosing talent because Kalani was the star of the show. You're here. Now you have to be perfect. Kalani Hilliker was one of Abby Lee Miller's favorite dancers, proving just how exceptional she really is. After all, it's not easy to get on Abby's star radar. Keep watching to find out what makes Kalani the best dancer of all time. She stepped out on that stage and looked like a million bucks. Unlike many of the other Dance Mom stars, Kalani Hilliker got her big break while competing on Abby's Ultimate Dance Competition. Although Kalani placed fourth in the competition, she managed to impress Abby, which isn't an easy thing to do. Once the show concluded, Kalani was asked to join the Abby Lee Dance Company and to appear on Dance Moms. Abby was smitten by Kalani's overall talents and physique. In Abby's eyes, Kalani has the natural look of a dancer, which is something she looks for in her students. Kalani is a stunning girl. I think she has that unique, special look. Now, it's no secret that Kalani was the strongest dancer on the team, and that's partially due to her having more experience than the other girls. Kalani was 14 years old when she joined the ALDC and had been dancing since she was a toddler. So evidently, Kalani was the star of the show. She is the strongest dancer on this team. Kalani is Abby's new star. On top of having the dancer look down packed and being an incredibly talented performer, Kalani is also reputed for having a stellar technique. Her movements are calculated, necessary, and perfectly executed, which just goes to show how talented she really is. It's easy to see that Kalani was trained to be a flawless dancer who knows the rules and theories behind every single dance. That's pretty. Kalani is the best technical dancer here. But having a good technique would mean nothing if Kalani didn't have the musicality to go along with it. But thankfully, the girls got musicality for days. She connects to the music she's dancing to on an intimate and raw level, which makes her such a joy to watch on stage. When Kalani dances, she's exactly where she wants to be, and it doesn't go unnoticed. But what did get noticed was that Kalani sometimes appeared bored while filming for Dance Moms, and that's partially due to her being one of the oldest dancers there. Because of her age, Kalani took on more of a leadership role than anything. Although Kalani enjoyed dancing in group numbers, she much preferred performing solos or dancing with a crew that was at her level. Baby Kalani's growing up, as Mia would say. <laughs> Kalani is a gifted dancer. There's no doubt about it. But something magical happens when she performs modern and contemporary dances. Kalani's floor work is iconic, which is why she excels when it comes to these types of solos. It's hard to take your eyes off Kalani when she's performing a floor number. She's so infatuated with the dance, making it impossible to look away. The dancer, the big Kalani? was not on that stage today. When it comes to accepting new dancers into the ALDC, Abby Lee Miller has a checklist that needs to be met, and, well, Kalani surpasses it. We all know how much Abby loves to teach dancers who can contort their bodies in peculiar ways, while demonstrating profound flexibility. So we're not too surprised that Abby had a soft spot for Kalani. After all, the girl is a contortionist through and through. You can do any type of warm-up, anywhere, like if you're watching TV, sit in your split. Just like Maddie Ziegler, Kalani can evoke on stage. Her emotions pour out of her, making her look like a light in the dark. Kalani can do this with ease because she's a naturally gifted actress. She portrayed Sabrina on the TV series Dirt and Ashley in Swiped. But just because someone can dance doesn't necessarily mean that they can sing and act, too. But Kalani is a triple threat if we've ever seen one. What's cool about this role is I am able to dance, but also I get to show my acting. Kalani marches to the beat of her own drum, and her fashion style tends to follow. It's very rare for young women to find a style that suits them before adulthood. But Kalani knows who she is and what she wants to wear. Call her quirky, trendy, or peculiar. But you can't deny that Kalani has a very unique taste in fashion. It's our first official week as the Irreplaceables. A handful of girls from the ALDC created a dance team called the Irreplaceables near the end of season 7. Only the most talented girls were allowed to join, and Kalani was one of them. After leaving Dance Moms, the girls went on tour. Kalani demonstrated just how talented she was by singing and dancing for fans all over the country. 
But before she could tour the country and join the all-girl group, Kalani had to learn the bases. Part of the reason why she has such a great technique is due to the extensive ballet training she received as a young child. Kalani took her first dance lesson when she was just two years old and began her ballet training at the Master Ballet Academy when she was five years old. So we're not too surprised that she has a technique in the bag. Step together, step together. Good. Like when Kalani isn't learning new dances, modeling, going to school, or hanging out with friends, she's filming for her popular YouTube channel. Kalani knows what people want, which is why she has over 740,000 subscribers on YouTube. She knows how to market herself, which has turned her into a reputable influencer. But what makes Kalani even more special is how sweet and funny she is. We love to watch her perform, and we love to hear her talk freely during exclusive interviews. She's just so hilarious. All that matters is that we had lots of fun. We did the best we could do. Who's your favorite Dance Mom star? Tell us in the comments. Subscribe to The Thing so you never miss the latest Dance Moms news. And give this video a big thumbs up. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again soon.